The Haircut. Dad persuaded Kipper to have his hair cut at a hairdresser's. He told Kipper that the hairdresser was so good at cutting hair that Kipper would really enjoy it. At first, Kipper wasn't too sure. So Dad said, I had my hair cut at a hairdresser when I was a little boy and I didn't make a fuss. I remember thinking it was good fun. Well, all right, said Kipper. But if going to a hairdresser is such fun, why does Mum always cut your hair? She doesn't always, said Dad. I tell you what, I'll have my hair cut at the same time as you. I bet you I won't make a fuss. So Dad took Kipper to a hairdresser in the high street. It was called Snips Hair Salon. The shop looked very bright and attractive. Snips is a good name for a hairdresser's, thought Kipper. The first thing that happened to Kipper and Dad, once they were in the salon, was that they had their hair washed. Dad had his washed by an assistant called Andy, and Kipper had his washed by an assistant called Nicky. Much to his surprise, Kipper enjoyed having his hair washed by Nicky. She didn't wash it in the way Mum did it at home. Instead, Kipper sat with his back to the basin and he leaned backwards. The basin didn't have taps. It had a special hose that Nicky could control by pressing a little trigger on the end. Nicky was very careful not to let any water run onto Kipper's face. Next to Kipper, Andy was shampooing Dad's hair. Be careful with all this foam, Kipper heard Dad say. I don't want shampoo in my eyes. I hope you won't let the water run down my neck. You will make sure the water isn't too hot, won't you? Dad's making a bit of a fuss, thought Kipper. After the shampooing was finished, Andy and Nicky sat Dad and Kipper on different chairs in front of a big, long mirror. Excuse me, sir, said Nicky. What would you like me to do with Kipper's hair? Shall I give him a trim? Dad remembered how quickly Kipper's hair grew. He remembered the fuss Kipper made whenever Mum cut it. And last of all, he saw how expensive it was to have a haircut in the salon. So he said, No, not just a trim. I think you'd better cut it short. Yes, quite short. And how about you, sir? said Andy. Kipper looked at Dad, and Dad looked at Kipper. Then Dad said, Oh, um, er, uh, yes, I'd like mine quite short too. Snip, 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 went the scissors. Kipper looked sideways at Dad. Dad didn't look too happy. I bet he did make a fuss when he was a little boy, thought Kipper. Dad and Kipper were really pleased with their haircuts. You look different, Kipper told Dad. So do you, Kipper, said Dad. You look different too. You look quite grown up with short hair. It will be really easy to keep it tidy, said Kipper. No more having it pulled when Mum tries to comb it. And it will be so much easier to wash. I'm glad we went to Snips. And you see, I didn't make a fuss. Not once. No, you were a good boy, said Dad. I wonder what Mum will say when she sees our smart new haircuts. Mum was home already. When she opened the front door and saw Kipper and Dad with their new short haircuts, she couldn't believe her eyes. Do you know what she said? She said, Good gracious, you both look as if you've been run over by a lawnmower. Now that wasn't very nice, was it? <laughs>